Hello everyone, welcome to the Open Euler and Friends demo. This video is a recording of the demo we have performed at the Open Euler Summit last winter. In this demo, we will deploy a series of famous open source software on top of a mixed cluster of ARM and x86 hardware and perform some tasks. This will give the audience a general view about the ARM data center software ecosystem. We will use Kubernetes as our infrastructure layer. While it's deploying, let me have a brief introduction about the whole stack. In this cluster, we will have a 4 ARM-based Quimpon server and 4 x86 server to forming a mixed cluster, and we will have Kubernetes on top of them. We will use Open Euler as the operating system, and on top of that, we will deploy famous open source softwares covering areas including storage, big data database, monitoring, and web servers. OK, the Kubernetes cluster has been deployed. Let's deploy Ceph to provide persistent storage for our cluster. We can use the token to log in the Kubernetes portal to check the status of the Ceph. We can see Ceph is deployed on mixed hardware. Next, we will deploy a Hadoop cluster on top of our mixed cluster and run a task to analyze the contributor statistics for Open Euler community in year 2020. The result will be displayed using our web services. And we can see we deployed a Hadoop cluster with one ARM worker and one x86 worker. It will then start the big data job. While the Hadoop job is running, let's have a look at the database. We will deploy two databases in this demo, an OpenGoss on ARM server and a MariaDB on x86 server. This could be a typical scenario when users start to add new ARM-based hardware to their system. We will import the data to the databases. If you have two databases, how to perform a combined query could be a problem. Well, we have a solution here. It is the OpenLocum project that could solve the problem. Let me show you how. First, we deploy the OpenLocum cluster and connect to those databases. Then we can go to the portal of OpenLocum and perform a combined query, just as easy as that. Monitoring is also very important for clusters. In this demo, we deployed promises to monitor our cluster. From the portal, we can see the detailed information for our clusters. And we can see that the CPU usage of our Hadoop cluster have a clear race when the job starts. For the last task of this demo, we will deploy a web services to display our contributor analysis results. Let's deploy and import the data. Refresh the website and we can see that the result about our contributors in year 2020. Okay, that's all for this demo. Thank you for your time. I hope you enjoy it.